everyone, we just launched a brand new channel called Proper Life, and in our first ever video that's linked down below in the description, Bert gets a butt tattoo! Go check it out now! Hey, baby. Mom? Yes, sweetie. Now keep your voice down. I know it's late where you are. Right. Why are you calling? I wanted to let you know that I'll be coming home for your senior graduation. That's great. But so far, are you coming home before then? Afraid not. I'm being transferred to a new base and they need me for a longer time. Oh, of course. We'll have to plan our girls' summer trip another time, okay? Okay. I love you, honey. I do. I love you too, Mom. All right. I've got to go. I'll call you as soon as possible. Okay. I'll talk to you soon. So, how did everyone's group stuff go yesterday? Mine was great. We had two new people, and one of them was fused with a bird. I'm not the Omega anymore. Well, how? Nikki said I earned my place as a normal ranking member and made one of the newbies Omega. Her name's Penelope. Isn't that the girl I saw with your roommate on the first day? Yeah, she's tough. She seemed pretty intimidating to be honest. Oh! I want to meet this girl. Why? I have a thing for tough girls. Oh really? Since when have you ever been interested in a tough girl? Back in the day I was. Remember when we were little kids? Okay, she was different. She was more just outright disobedient and had an attitude. Still, she was tough. <sighs> Whatever, Finn. Speaking of tough girls, uh, where's Talon? You consider Talon a tough girl? She's a lot stronger than you give her credit for. Exactly. Has anyone seen her this morning? I haven't. Me neither. Weird. I wonder if she'll go to training today. I'll go wait outside her class for her. See if she shows. Okay, good. Speaking of class, it's about time we get going. Right. Fusion bots, roll out! I hate you. Aw, oh, come on. Will? What are you doing here? You weren't at breakfast. So? Are you okay? Fine. Fine is a no bueno word. What's going on? Just, my mom called in the middle of the night. Is she okay? What did she say? She'll be home for my senior graduation. But not before, will she? No. Oh, Taylin. Be okay. I'm never going anywhere, and neither are my parents. We're always here for you. I know. Thanks, Bubba. <laughs> Haven't heard that one in a while. <laughs> I only use it when you deserve it. Well, it's good to hear, sis.
Good to finally meet you, Griffin. Nice to meet you too. So, how are you liking everything so far? It's okay, it just wasn't everything I expected. Like what? Well, since you don't know what animal you'll be paired with, you never know what group you'll end up in. I didn't expect to become part of a pack, I guess. Do you not like the pack? I don't mind it, but I hate Penelope being the Omega. Are they mistreating her? It's too soon to tell, but I'm afraid they will. I won't stand for people mistreating her, Griffin. As the previous Omega, I took all the heat for the beginning time of the pack, and I will never let it get as bad as it did for me. R really Really. I would hate for anyone to suffer like I did my freshman and sophomore year. I will help make it as easy as possible for her. Thank you, Zack. What is your relation to her anyways? Strangely enough, not sure. We're friends, I guess? You mean, you two didn't know each other before? No, we met at orientation. Whoa, by the way she seems to act around you. I thought she was your girlfriend or something. Girlfriend? Honestly, so did I. No, and I don't know why we got so close this quickly, honestly. Ever consider she likes you? Not really. I feel like we still barely know each other. Well, then maybe try and figure it out rather than get upset with her. Yeah, you're probably right. I've just never had someone take a bullet like that from me before. Well, get used to it. Around here, we have each other's backs. <laughs> I'll try. So, tell us more about yourself, Griffin. Why do you come to the school? I was invited because I'm a national champion in photography. I like film and such, and the school supposedly wants to expand in their extracurricular activities. Oh, I didn't know that. You think we'll have any new events this year because of it? I hope so. Maybe there'll be a show or something to watch. Or maybe I could record something to show for the school. That would actually be great. I've even thought about getting a camera to just shoot things I see around campus grounds. This school has some interesting things that happen on the daily. Tell me about it. Have you heard the story about Finn hitting on the lunch lady, not knowing she was half snake? No. Zack! So here's what happened. When we first came to the school for orientation, we stopped to get some food. Finn spotted the lunch lady and decided to talk to her. So explain this project to me again. Well, I have to get a plant and study it on my own without having any knowledge beforehand. The teacher wants to test our observatory skills. That's actually a difficult project. What do you have to list? My hypothesis on its properties and its structure. Well, to be fair, I would love to help. Thanks, but I need to do this on my own. If I have help from you, I'll do suspiciously well. Not true. I'm not a plant expert. Don't have to be. You're just smarter than I am. You can't just say I'm automatically smarter than you. You have none of the same classes to look at grades side by side. Well, it's blatantly obvious. No, it isn't. You have no factual proof. You, you just... Would you just take the compliment? Wait, you're trying to compliment me? In a very underhanded way, yes. <laughs> oh, uh, then thank you. You're welcome. Now... What you're reading? The manual you gave me last year. You still have it? Well, of course. Right. Still trying to study the ways to fly? Yeah, I actually wanted to ask you if you wanted to help me. Of course I would. I'd love to be a part of helping the first flying student here. There's one problem. I can feel my wings, but I don't think I have full control of them. Huh. Maybe I can help you with that. I want to go into nursing and physical therapy like my parents. So I know a thing or two about it. Maybe we can use the same method on your wings. That's actually a really good idea. Actually, I want to try something. Can I touch your wings? Uh, yeah, sure. Wow, your feathers are a, a lot softer than I anticipated. Uh, yeah, the, they're pretty soft. Now, I'm going to move your wings a little. And I want you to tell me if you feel it in your back. I actually do feel it a little. That's good. 
Maybe you can come to my parents' office on the weekend sometimes. Because obviously your nerves recognize the wings as a part of you. You just don't know how to use them properly. This is great! I'm definitely gonna go. And you're coming with me. Well, of course. How else would you know where it is? <laughs> right. <laughs> <laughs> now, I gotta get to the lab and run some tests on this plant. See you at the dorm? Yeah, see ya. place to have dinner. I thought so as well. So, any reason you didn't want to eat in our normal spot? I just thought you might like a change of scenery is all. Dear, you know I can't see too well. I will admit it does smell nicer in here though. Darcy. Yes? I wanted to tell you something. Alright, then tell me. You have helped me in so many ways in this past year. I don't think you realize how much I truly appreciate you. And you- You aren't the only one. You have also helped me a lot. And I thoroughly enjoy your company. Ever since you caught me in the teacher workroom, I knew you'd be a part of my life. Miss Darcy, are you alright? Uh, I'm alright. Are you sure? Yes, I just need to... need to... You could say that you fell for me, couldn't you? Yes, I guess so. <laughs> I felt for you too. Will you marry me? Yes! <laughs> <laughs>